everybody. I am Russ. This is Chris. It is Monday and it's early. It is early. We're going early today. What a great game. Y'all don't, they don't ever know. No. What time we do it. But. What a great, we're an hour early today. <sighs> Super Bowl 51. <clears throat> is it the greatest Super Bowl ever played? Ooh. Half of it was. I mean, the comeback half. Yeah. I thought Atlanta played just as good the first half as New England did the second half. I agree with that. I agree with that. And uh, I was watching, if you guys don't know, but Chris Hoke, our other partner in Red Sea, they do the Incredible Hoax. And right after the game last night, they did their show, and I watched it. And I, I great Tom Brady is the greatest quarterback ever. I can't. I can't argue, and I can't argue with it. There, and I. This is what my shirt is in honor of Tom Brady. He is now. I think a I'm. Le- old, he's a legend. He's a legend. He's a legend. We'll see if we can get him one of these shirts made. Legends. <clears throat> this was our softball shirt, but that dude is a freaking winner. Okay, now that we don't play softball, I'll I'll say this. Yeah. There was many times in our late years, right? You know, and you guys, you guys traveled, but. There was many times in our late years that we beat teams that probably were as good as a, as as our team, right? But the legend factor came in. The crap talking to them, the ah, the stigma of of it came into it, and I think it rattled Atlanta. Atlanta. Felt them coming. I, 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 I am so with you on that. Sometimes it's not about the talent. Uh, Trent Diffler, Trent, uh, uh, Diff, Diffler, what is his name? Dilfer. Dilfer said it. He said the experience. He says before the game. He said, I think Atlanta is just as talented, but the experience of the Patriots will. And he said that before the Super Bowl. He was absolutely I right. think I think Atlanta was more talented. And, yes. and I, I really think they were more talented. But the one thing you saw or didn't see on the New England sideline from the coach, oh, I agree. from the quarterback, was never, oh, what are we going to do? Yep. Oh, it I was, totally it was, it's going right. I think he was just writing down, just wait. We'll be back. <laughs> <clears throat> Just think of it, the, they never got flustered on the interception he throws. No. Nope. And every one of them in the press conference, if you watch a little bit after, every receiver, everybody went, dude, he, he was calm. He was like, all right, let's go, you know, <clears throat> execute our plays. I hate to use this reference, <clears throat> but I think Tom Brady has what all great ones have. And the, the person they said used to have it was Tiger Woods. He don't anymore. No. If he hit a bad shot, it was he. He never thought yeah, of it. Again. It was done. He had such a strong mind that he put it out of his head. And I think Tom Brady and all the great ones have the Jordan. Jordan you know, said about all the those focus people. Yeah, I, I think they that. all they all have that. I think they do exactly. They get into that tunnel vision. Yeah, and it is just I am going to do what Bill Belichick says. I'm going to do my job. Hats off, man. Hats off to you Patriots and Patriot fans. And nobody took your money. Nobody won your $100. So, good Fourth job. Fourth year in a row. We actually... We're not adding that all together for no, next year, no. trust me. We actually won a uh, little backyard pot. You won on a $2 pot. So, I'm only down right now, after all the Super Bowl pots, $263. Dang it. Frustration sets in. Well, I'm not down quite that much because I hit that $50 one, that, the $2 deal. So, if Meredith, if you're watching, mm. just keep that for those Maverick tickets. There you go. You take us to the Maverick game here next month. So, so just, there you go. Just there keep it. Go. Good job, Meredith. You just made you some money. Or actually. She probably got them free, but I'm still going to pay for them. I, I don't know. All right, man. Super Bowl, besides <clears throat> the game, brings out the commercials. Or lack thereof. Lack thereof. And I 
I think it was because we all went into the peace and love, peace and love, peace and love. That's all pretty much all I saw. Coke did it a bunch. But anyway, I have two commercials. And one I'm going to make fun of, but the other one I thought was funny. And we both agreed on this commercial right here. That's all right, son. Get right back up. You're all right. Oh, check out that Buick. Wow, that's nice. But if that's a Buick, then my kid's Cam Newton. <laughs> Ready! Damn! Blue for the two set up. Some people just can't believe the new Buick. That's a good looking Buick right there. That's a Buick, and I'm a supermodel. Nice play, Billy! Miranda Kerr? Oh. I, I thought that was the best one. I totally agree. As soon as it happened, we're texting. Me, him, and Hoke are yeah. texting back and forth, and bam, we, we text. Now, the one I thought was funniest was by 84 Lumber. It was about the Mexican mom and the Mexican daughter making their way. Well, I think that was more about the text going back and forth. Now that, but listen, <laughs> listen, is that the same, to me, is that the same as the truth when you smoke? They're like showing you the truth, which means they show you smoke, but you shouldn't smoke. So they show the mom and the Mexican daughter, and they show the lumber company at the end. And I, I sent Chris a text, and I went, that was the lumber company showing. They, they fixing to the build a wall. <laughs> I think that's that lumber company going, we can't build anything if y'all put the wall up. That's oh, my here. God. But I don't know. It's funny. I, just I, I enjoyed the, the, the baby. That was funny. The baby commercial. The Super Bowl babies. Going yeah. back through the Super Bowls. That and funny. I also enjoyed uh, the spot. The that pie. Terry, Terry Brad. And yeah. then when they brought it back. Yeah. At the end. But, but man, Snickers was horrible with the live deal. Right after the deal, that was I didn't like that. Doritos doesn't even make an appearance except for the drone thing uh, when he's eating the Doritos. Yeah, that's crazy. They just they just didn't. Hats off to Hyundai. Oh, Hyundai, however you want to say yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was after the show where they went and, and brought three service people and it made them feel like they were at the game. That with their was family. That was that was that ball was that three sixty deal. Yeah, was, was bad. that was pretty cool. I will say this. <clears throat> Kudos, everybody was kind of griping. Kudos to Lady Gaga for doing a good halftime show with no political stuff. She just got out there and sang. So I don't I don't have to like her, I don't do nothing. She just got out there and performed. 41,000 tweets. Lady Gaga. Was going. I, I went back through, and uh, our friend Tawny that lives in New York yeah. is a huge fan. Uh a few of them that, I mean, they're like, the queen has risen. I mean, they are diehard <laughs> Lady Gaga fans. And I can't say that if her stuff comes on the radio, yeah, don't I don't it. sing along with yeah. it because I do. You know, that I think that's the making. T Taylor Swift, let her song come on. Everybody knows yeah. it because they're actually good. We just don't want to admit it. I still think we go back to. Haters will hate successful Ooh. people. It don't matter who you are. And winners are winners. And winners are winners. Golly, man. What a great game. And let me tell you something. Let me tell you how I sat down and I got ready to party with everybody I know. That I mean, not that I know, but all my closest friends. This is me by myself. Me too. And here's how it goes. Pre-game zone. I'm watching the bowling deal. I get all my stuff done in the morning. Everything's set down. I said, Stephanie. Game starts at 5.30. She said, okay. And I'm watching the bowling stuff. She's talking. I said, game's business start. You ready? She said, hey, I just started this documentary of a serial killer. I'm like, what? Are you going to watch Super Bowl? She was like, call me in on the commercials. There was no okay. point of that. I said, okay. So I'm sitting in that chair, and we did good. <clears throat> Went out and had our got our spread, got our... Uh, vegetables and all this stuff 
And I'm sitting there going, let me just text Chris real quick. And <laughs> text Hulk. And that was, that's well, how I watched in, it. Well, in my house, there was one sick Indian that never got out of bed. Well, and I hope you I, better today. My new grill, I got it in the back. Got me some bratwurst sausage. That you know, see it? Because you gotta, oh, you gotta yeah, yeah. season the grill, right? right you know, right, so right, it's right. a good thing to use sausage and oil and. Yeah. So I cooked me a big pack. I had nobody to help me eat those, <laughs> so I just commenced to eating them all. <laughs> I ate them with chips. I ate them as a sandwich. I might even put some on my cereal. I don't know, but they were damn good. Super Bowl brings out a lot of parties, but I knew I didn't want to go anywhere. I knew Stephanie didn't want to go anywhere, but I thought, man, I can't wait to watch Super Bowl. Me either. Oh, it took forever for it to come on. Yeah, that that was that was tough, man. That was that was a lot. But great season. It's over. Next year, Cowboys are winning the Super Bowl. I am marking the day right now. February the sixth. Cowboys will win the Super Bowl next year. They got to get through Atlanta because they're going to be tough for a while. I agree. I'm calling it, though. I'm saying it right now. Marcus Ware? Marcus Ware, and now they're talking to Adrian Adrian Peterson. Peterson. But we got the best running back, Ezekiel Elliott. That's a heck of a backup. I would bring in Adrian and let him run behind that good line, save Ezekiel, go back and forth. I just, ooh. A little defensive help I think will be fine. All right, man. I thank y'all for all your picks and all that stuff. Today was just Super Bowl talk and a lot of comments. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Pitto for always commenting stupid crap on my on my Facebook. Yeah. I appreciate that, Pitto. Uh, Hollywood watching, Billy's watching. Of course, you got uh, uh, two regulars Fish. like Aaron and Dar- uh, Dwayne and all. Dwayne, those. Aaron Bird, and all them. Uh, Maddie and Phoenix. Man, thank y'all. We appreciate it. Watch, like, share. We got some good stuff coming up this week. And uh, the lunch special should be up. We don't know what it was, but it's up now. I know it is. I'm happy about that. You got anything for this week? Yep, I got the lunch special. Ready? Ooh, go. Philly tots. <gasps> so it's tater tots covered in the Philly meat oh and peppers. Gosh. and Oh, sounds good. Sounds I've good. got to stay away sounds from that. Sounds good. Staying away today. Staying away. Uh, <clears throat> is our big new camera gonna work? I'm just gonna let that go. Is that? Nah, I don't see. I was just giving you. Okay, all right. Until tomorrow, I am Russ. This is Chris, and we are.